everyone, this is Game Watcher 1996, and today um, we're I'm just gonna go through this uh, new game with y'all. It's called uh, Energyville, and um, it's really fun. And you'll learn a lot about um, how um, about saving nature, and um, it's just a really fun game. So we're gonna go ahead and get started. If you're a first-time player, I would suggest to click on the guided play, but I already played it, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, do ready to play. Um, begin game, but first of all, you need to click on. Um, you need to name your city. I'm gonna name it Game Watcher, and I'm gonna hit Ready to Play. And what we're gonna do here in this um, part of the screen, I'm just gonna scroll down here. Um, now we're gonna get started. So as you can see, there's the exclamation marks. Those are the ones that are not powered. If you want to get more information on, you just click on them and uh, learn more. This will tell you how much power is going to it, and uh, so that's how you can check to see how much power you need. And um, then let's look over here at the economic. The economic is, I believe, how much the how much is being paid for your electricity, and the environment is um, you want to keep that bar low because that'll help keep the environment in good shape. And your security, um, um, I don't really know what that is, but that's um, something to watch out for too. You don't want that one getting too high or too low. Um, the energy management score. This is your score that you'll receive as you play the game. So we're going to go ahead and play it and we're going to go with our first power source and we're going to use a sun. Um, use a sun source and we're going to go ahead and click on this and we're going to go ahead and click on add more solar and uh, right now that's the ma that's as much as we can put on there is just two solar panels so um, as you can see our economic went up and um, we started powering some um, buildings so let's continue we're going to drag out a, um, a windmill here to give us some basic power and this right here is very environment friendly as long as with the solar power because it's not burning gas to hurt the environment so that's a great way to use it and then there's also Hydro. Hydro is a good way to save the environment too, and it gives a pretty good bit of power. That's um to collect power from that, and you get some security. You want to keep the security in the green. Um, you don't want nothing to get in the red. You want to just keep it like you should, um, like in the green, or even yellow is okay too. And that will just give you a higher score. So as you see, our score is starting to go up. And um, different places need different things. Like for instance, cars need. Uh, vehicles need gas, so we're going to go ahead and use um, we're going to use some petroleum, and we're going to drag that out there, and it, it goes out in the sea. And we're going to go ahead and click on that, and I'm gonna add more petroleum. And that'll give us more power for that. And as you can see, our economics starting to go up a little bit, so we want to be careful on that, or else that will uh, start to make things. Uh, get worse but we still have good environment and good security so um, we're just going to continue on as you can see there ain't there's not as much um, exclamation marks the check marks is the ones we saved so far and we're going to go ahead and try to do a um, biomass and it also on each one of these it gives the, the description of of what this is over here on the right and we're just going to place it over here um, here and that helps save a lot more too and it keeps your environment really in great shape economic in good shape but it gives a little bit more security and um, so now what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and click on uh, natural gas and we're going to place it right here or out in the sea actually and now our uh, city is powered and as you can see all our stuff is in the yellow but that's okay we did really great for the first level this is our uh, score for the first level, and we're gonna go ahead and go to the next. One. And all right, so now what we do here is we have three options, and it really depends on how your economic environment and security go. Like I say, the less you got one, the better. Um, so what we got here is this right here is a really easy option. I mean to choose from. You know, you want negative to decrease because we don't want to increase nothing these two decrease more security and environmental impact but makes your economic impact go up but what we're going to do is we're going to choose 
I'm gonna choose this one because this will decrease all it won't decrease the environment and security as much but it's still a good choice because it makes them all go down um, so now between um, between now and 2015 this is going down this is going down the timeline here and this is just telling about how the years went by and how good stuff went or how bad stuff went and that stuff so. Alright, so now we're in 2015, and um, this right here is going to be level 2, and it stops at 2030, so let's go and get started here. Alright, so what we're going to do now is we are going to go ahead, what I like to do is come over here to our solar power and add more solar power. Um, the solar power will make your economic go up a lot, but so be careful on that. And we also have new, um, we also have new facilities too, like for instance, um, a hydrogen plant. Just drag that right there. That made our economic go pretty bad, but um, it really took care of all the stuff. And now what we're going to do is we're going to go to an oil shell and we're going to place it, let's see, right there, right there. we're going to place it right there. And we've got to really watch our economic right now. So, um, let me see what we got here. And this right here gives you the stats of all of your, um, all of the different plants you got and what you need. So we need more um, petroleum for the fuel. And we're going to see if we can upgrade. If you place it out there, it'll place on top of it too. So now our city is powered. Our environment and economic are bad and our security is getting close to being bad. But we're going to go ahead and continue on to the next level. Alright, so here's where we need to really start looking. So, our security is a lot better than our economic and environment. So we need to choose the right plan, um, or you can just keep your, or you can just keep it the way it is. But we need to choose a plan that will really help out. Like for instance, um, we could probably do this one right here. I'm sorry. Uh, yeah, this one right here, because this right here will um, help those two. Because either way, our money is just going to increase. So. Might as well choose one that'll help. Okay, so now our environment is back in yellow, but our economic got a little bit worse. Alright, so now between um, between now and 2030, it's going down the timeline again. This is 2022. Next, 24, and 2030. Alright, so let's see here. So that's pretty much, um, right there you have two levels, and I just don't fill out the form, and this will give you your status on how you did, and if you work, if you work with a, um, a team to help out, or organization to help out the environment, you can, um, you can fill out these forms here, but here's your average, this is my score compared to the average score, so I did pretty good, and this is the, your results here, and that's how you play, um, Energy Feel. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, comment, rate. Bye.